Hello everyone, welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm Arrow in the Knee, and today we're going to be looking at uh, Harpies. Uh, these cards have been around since uh, the second set, since Metal Raiders, um, the original Harpy Lady. Uh, yeah, interesting card, but pretty damn shit. Um, but with the new releases uh, of Harpy Channeler and Harpy Dancer, uh, along with Hysteric Sign, this deck is quite good at the moment. Um, and I'll just have a quick uh, go through all this. Uh, I'm going to set it to Z. And I'm going to um, uh, read out the names of the cards just so you guys who don't know what the cards are can, you know. Alright, so we've got three Cyber Harpy Lady. They count as Harpy Lady. You can't have Harpy Lady, Cyber Harpy Lady because its name is treated as Harpy Lady. Uh, look, it won't let you take a, uh, where is it, a Harpy Lady 1, 2, or 3, because we've got them. Anyway, two Ducks and Mork. Uh, these are testing at the moment. I'm not sure about them. Uh, three Harpy Channeler, three Harpy Dancer, three Harpy Queen, two Harpy Pet Baby Dragon. I might be taking those out. Two Harpy Pet Dragon. Looks pretty shit, but it has some really good combos. One Sangan, obviously with the new list, he's gone. Uh, uh, summon Priest times two. Summon a Monk, if you call the American. Name blah blah blah. Uh, two tour guides, a dark hole, two hun uh, harpies hunting ground. Uh, I've got to learn to breathe. Uh, heavy storm, three hysteric sign, which is probably the best fucking card ever. Uh, Swallow's nest, three hysteric party, three accursed attack, mirror force, solemn judgment, two warning. One of those is going to be on the next list, and a torrential. This is my first build. I haven't looked at anyone else's build. I just looked through the cards and thought, oh, this is kind of good. So this is by no means the finished version. But this is what I'm going to be playing now. And I think throughout the game we're going to be like... Uh, yeah, we'd like to say that. Throughout the game I'm going to be like, oh, I wish I had that. So, yeah. Um, let's host duel. Hopefully this goes pretty well. Uh, I hate it when people troll and shit, but... Bus is not fair. Hmm. I don't get it. Vampire, <laughs> Vampire Lord. <laughs> oh god. Let's go Scissors. I don't know why. Uh, first I'm going to go Scissors then, but I'm probably going to go Rock next. Oh. Oh. Stick Paper. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Fucking just go back to Paper, dickhead. I don't mean you're a dickhead. But there we go. Alright. First or... Oh. <sighs> All right, we open pretty good here, and um, let's see. With Happy Channel, you can go into a lot of things, but the best thing to bring out is Happy Pet Dragon, and uh, Happy Channel's effect makes it into a level seven, so you can make a seven star exceed, which is insane. Um, there's uh, this guy, Phantom Beastcraft. Uh, I think he can't be destroyed while the tokens are on the field. Is that right? Um, you can detach next to the material, get two phantom tokens. While you control a token, this card can be just, cannot be destroyed. Yeah, it just can't be destroyed. Uh, you contribute one phantom beast. Mo yeah, okay. Let's let's just go into that. That'll be fun. Uh, happy channeler. Um, the effect. Hopefully, uh, just got one happy card. I'm gonna get rid of the hunting ground. We're going to special on Happy Pet Baby Dragon. Uh, Happy Pet Dragon, sorry. And then we're going to go into the Seven Star Guy. This doesn't matter if it's in defense. Is it in defense? Yeah, it's defense. Okay, and then we're going to detach and get two tokens in defense. Um, and I think that's a really good move because he, he has to, even if he dark holds, he's not going to kill my. Phantom Beastcraft guy. Um, so then we're going to look in a grave. I wish I had a dark monster here, but I can't really do too much, so I'll set Torrential just, just in case there's some crazy shit pulls off. Turn down my volume, obviously. Uh, I like that as an OP move, actually. Uh, dark World Dealings, I can't really do anything about that. I uh, drew Icarus of Type, which I kind of want to keep. Um, I'm going to discard Hysteric Sign so I get its effect. What's he targeting? The back card, okay. I kind of like that I've got this this defense here, because it'll take him a lot to get through it. Um, he has to destroy both my tokens first. 
so I'll have to get a big field. And even then, I, I have historic part, uh, historic sign. So I get like three. It's insane. When it's discarded during the end phase, you get three happy cards with different names. I mean, fuck. F of slain. He's like, oh, this sucks. <laughs> um, so I'll get one happy channel, one happy dancer, and one happy fucking armor. Let's go for a happy queen. Why not? Look at that. From one card, we just get all this shit. Draw a card. Um, let's remove that. Destroy. Um, this card cannot... Okay. Um, we draw a historic sign, which is really funny. Um, do we have a dark monster around? We do not. Alright, it's got a happy channel. The effect. Um, we'll discard a, I don't know, Cyber Harpy Lady. And we will special summon. Um, hmm. I don't even know. Uh, let's, let's go with Harpy's Pet Dragon again. <laughs> let's make Big Eye. Why not? Um, I'm just, I'm gonna run three of these guys, the Phantom Beast Crafts. Because I didn't realize how good they were. Um, for fuck's sake, I'm trying to make this guy. And he quits. Because this deck is awesome. Alright, we're gonna go quickly because I think this video can last a bit longer. We're gonna go to the deck constructor and what's that thing called? I'm gonna take away one of these shot masters, which are cool, and one of the Mirage Dragons, and what's this guy called? Uh, Phantom Beastcraft. It's insanely good, it's a great opening move. Doesn't cost you too much. Um, so we're gonna save that. Go ahead and that again. And let's um, let's have one more game before I finish up this. And uh, I, I think I'll, I'll do a few videos with this deck. Uh, and we'll slowly see um, what I turn the deck into. Whether or not I add other things. Um, I like Dark Sim more, but I'm not sure about whether or not it's, you know, the best. Um, so... Uh, the reason I run Dark Smoke on top of this is you can go um, the Channeler into Dragon and use Swallow's Nest on it. Oh god, this is going to be a burner. Not what I wanted to see. Um, do I have anything that can actually stop a burner deck? I don't think I do. This is just too generic. Oh, I've got Shockmaster I can deal with. Uh, but yeah. We'll see. Mm. So he took a Jammer Trio. Um, is he going to set five? That's Morphing Jammer. Oh god. Feels bad, bro. Oh, I can actually do something. I, th I hope. Uh, just got Harpy Queen. View deck. Let's go grab ourselves a Harpy's Hunting Ground, shall we? Okay. Harpy's Hunting Ground. And an awesome. Watch skill drain. Destroy that. This guy now has 2100 attack. Now chain link 1, chain link 2, chain link 3. And I imagine that's a. Uh... Oh, it's chain strike. So that's four, two thousand. He gets to draw two. Alright, those tokens are your draws. Um, thinking of attacking, do I really want to? Um, hmm. Okay. Let's attack and hope it's not Mask of Darkness. It's just Marshmallow. Okay. I can deal with that, I think. Um, Alright, let's end up turn. Let's see if he goes for the old uh, Lava Golem play. 
Am I missing something? Oh, he can't draw, can he? Yeah. Okay, so that's one. Take my eyes off. Okay, um... Let's go like this. Discard House of Dragon. Switch some Happy Queen. Destroy that. Skip it, okay. Um, let's draw for a turn. Swallow's Nest. Um, okay. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe I should just end and let him do stuff. Happy Spent Mirage Dragon. What four stars could I use? <laughs> I do want to get through that guy, though. Um, I might Swallow's Nest, destroy that back card. These these are Drama Trio tokens, make it a little harder to do anything. What are they, beast types, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They're not winged beasts, that's for sure. Um, alright. This is a bit ugly. Um, let's let him draw a card, but I get to get rid of his Marshmallow. He takes a thousand. Really good card. It's a plant! What the fuck? It's a ship! Um, and then... Set his third party and end. That's his second one. Um, let's see what he does now. I'm gonna historic party in the end phase. No, I don't really need to. Well, I do now. Um, but is it really worth it? Um, I wish I could keep Swallow's Nest, that's the thing. But if I don't do it in the end phase, you can play that card. Um, yeah, sure, let's just let it go. Alright, let's go for historic party again. See if it's got negation. Pop. Is it cheatable? It is not. Happy with that. Okay, Swallow's Nest. Special Moon. Um, yeah, let's go with Happy Channeler. Destroy that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's two thousand, right? Um, destroy a card. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay. That worked out pretty well, I think. We're a bit locked down if he has any other things. But I do have warning, which can stop, I don't know, whatever. But I am a bit locked down. But I, I can destroy face of monsters if need be with the black ship guy. I like this, it's a really good fucking card. I mean, God, 2100. You can destroy whatever. I think I might have won since he's taking forever. And usually with this many cards in a burner deck, you usually just set. So it's over. So I think he's kind of got nothing. That's kind of my thing. Unless he has a really big move that he could do with two cards, maybe Reborn or something, I don't know. Something tells me he hasn't got anything. Yeah. Um, let's just attack. Let's go for the game. Dimension Wall, Dimension Wall. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Thanks for the game. Alright, uh, thanks for watching everyone, um, we will uh, revisit this deck in the next one because I obviously will want to make changes to it. definitely never like a 42 card deck anyway. Um, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time, bye.